volunteers have an enormous impact on the spirit and overall well-being of our community. If you stop and think about it for a moment, I'll bet you know an O'Fallon resident who has given their expertise for the betterment of our community. Just think of all the ways the volunteers make a difference in day-to-day -day life here in O'Fallon. Volunteers help to keep our neighborhoods, streets, parks, green spaces, and water clean and safe for everyone. They also help to enhance services provided to our residents by supporting festivals, recreational activities, athletic competitions, and more. They make a direct impression on our residents, businesses, visitors, and staff, some that reach far beyond our borders. Residents, the volunteers that come out and not only on our boards and commissions, but come out here for Garden Expo Day, for Founders Day, for Fourth Heritage and Freedom Fest. It's all our volunteers that help make our city what it is, and without our volunteers, I don't think O'Fallon would be what we are today. O'Fallon volunteers get together for a common cause without expecting anything in return. Volunteers have a passion for giving back, and a number of them cross into different areas of service. This means that you'll find volunteers in offices and city parks, at monuments and historical sites, in creeks or along roadways, or just sitting behind the dais in the chambers at City Hall. Now let's see why our volunteers enjoy making O'Fallon one of the best places to live in America. City volunteers take pride in supporting nearly two dozen departments and they value the relationships they have forged with staff throughout their years of service. They offer up their unique skills and their personal time to support city departments. Each volunteer has one trait in common, their commitment to the city of O'Fallon and its staff. We had a chance to ask some city volunteers why they volunteer for O'Fallon and we hope to find out more about this very personal choice. It doesn't really matter what you're doing as a volunteer, you're doing it because you want to do it. It's not something that you're made to do. Yes, of course you're asked to do, but you do it because you want to do. And most of us, even when we're finished with a job, will turn right around and say, okay, what else you got to do? Because we just, it's in our hearts and uh, we just give it everything that we've got. I enjoy being a volunteer at City Hall because I enjoy being with the people and they're fun and we have a good time and get a lot of work done. I volunteer because I love it. I love the people I uh, volunteer with. Um, I've been volunteering for 10 years now and um, it's just, just a great satisfaction. I love volunteering because I want to stay busy really and contribute wherever I can. I really love volunteering because I've met so many f wonderful people. It gives you friendship, it gives you love, and it gives you something to do. It's enjoyable. I love people. Well, I was looking for something to do and I wanted to keep my mind active. And uh, this work kind of fit it in similar to the type of work I did. So. Gives her something to do, something purposeful to do. I find that by coming here, if I can help one person with any kind of problem, it also helps make me feel better that I've been my chance to give to the veterans. I thought maybe I could help a widow through the process, um, not just the grieving process, but how to uh, go on with your life and uh, 
you have friends um, and you develop um, a camaraderie and it's very rewarding um, to be able to do this. Volunteerism is an extension of civic duty and community pride. And serving on O'Fallon's boards, committees, and commissions is a popular option for getting involved. These 100 plus conscientious change agents thoughtfully advise council on policy issues prior to final decisions affecting residents and businesses. Well, you know, I don't really look at it as volunteering. I look at it as my civic duty, uh, as a citizen volunteer, uh, to help uh, in any capacity that I can to guide the direction of the city. The Public Works Commission focuses their attention on the pursuit of O'Fallon infrastructure improvements in accordance with the city's strategic plan. You live in the community, you want to get involved, and what better way to get involved than volunteering? Uh, and this is a voluntary position, but from this we, you know, you can also volunteer for different events that happen through the course of the year. And the Board of Adjustment reviews requests to modify existing homes and businesses on a case-by-case -case basis. I volunteered because I, I think it is a, uh, a, a duty of every citizen to try to support the governance of a, of a city and uh, try to be reasonable and informed as a citizen, if not as a voter. The O'Fallon Historic Preservation Commission provides a means to promote the cultural, economic, and general welfare of the public through the preservation and protection of structures and areas of historic and cultural interest within the city of O'Fallon. My grandmother used to say it takes less energy to get something rolling to keep something rolling than it does to start something rolling. And I'm rolling, I'm already busy, I'm already thinking, I'm already awake, I'm already alive, and I want to make a difference. So that's why I volunteer. The Parks Board continues updating the Parks Master Plan, ensuring all city parks are welcoming areas for residents to enjoy, including the newly installed skate park in Westoff Park. The Mayor's Youth Advisory Council proves that O'Fallon's younger generation is eager to be involved. The group hosts candidate forums and assist in the preparation of O'Fallon's annual Fall Fest 5K Fun Run. I really wanted to affect a positive change within my community and amongst my peers. And I'm just very, very excited to be president of MIAC, and I think that I will be able to take this council to a place it has never been before. The Veterans Commission coordinates ceremonies and events while also providing outreach information to local veterans. Why do I volunteer with the Veterans Commission? Well, because I learned a long time ago that the veterans need all the help they can get. It's very important that they have a place where they can go and get information on whatever they need to know. The Convention and Visitors Bureau enhances the means for tourism within O'Fallon by encouraging opportunities that build upon the city's vision. The O'Fallon Senior Resident Advisory Committee represents O'Fallon's aging population by identifying needs and has been instrumental in growing programs that promote the health and safety of our local seniors. I like to give back to the community. Um, we've only been here 10 years and I really have appreciated, you know, the hospitality actually of the city. So I, I wanted, and they got a lot of good things. And I thought if I could give something back and help out in some way to continue that, I think that'd, that's my goal. The Advisory Green Council educates our community on a number of topics that ensures our residents enjoy clean air and water and sustainable natural resources. The City of O'Fallon hosts community events that require the support of a few thousand volunteers annually. Those who enjoy festive atmospheres may choose to help out at the Heritage and Freedom Fest. Anyone with an interest in athletic competitions might be seen at the Alligators Creek Triathlon or at one of our 5K runs. And volunteers who love holidays are assisting children as they visit with the Easter Bunny or good old Saint Nick. Volunteers come in all ages and abilities, senior citizens and youth, families and individuals, but they all share a common trait, supporting O'Fallon while sharing their passion for fun. Now let's take a look at some of this year's event volunteers in action.
I get a kick out of all the kids coming through and uh, they enjoy this so much and it really makes them happy and it makes me happy. It puts me in the holiday spirit. I volunteered because at my school I'm in Key Club and that's a community service organization and I love helping people and kids. You have to pay it forward or you have to give back and I have no money to pay it forward so I have to give it back. Just to see like people be happy when we help them and it's just like nice to see smiles on people's faces. Why do I volunteer? Uh, well last year was because my girlfriend begged me to. But this year, uh, it's because I had a lot of fun coming last year and I plan to keep coming to it just because of how much fun I had the very first time. So our team is very excited and my husband this year is doing, with it, doing this with me, so it's awesome because I'm sure he didn't want to come out in the heat. You get to meet everybody coming in here and when they're leaving, all the good times they had and all the fun. Watch the families and the children and everything, yeah. Energy when they come and zonk when they leave. That's right. <laughs> means being a part of the community and as a family we get to spend more time together you know because as we go off during the week we're all working and, and just doing our own thing but when we're able to volunteer we're able to be together as a family and just just be supportive of each other and, and also our community. I like to get involved with the community and to do things that are different from my, my normal uh, daily job and to uh, the meet the people and find out there's, there's so many things going on and different things happening in O'Fallon. Volunteer Services sponsors a number of National Days of Service here in O'Fallon, including Martin Luther King Day, Earth Day, Youth Service Week, Join Hands Day, the National Day of Service and Remembrance, Make a Difference Day, and Family Volunteer Day. Each with a different focus, but all centered upon civic and community engagement. Volunteering and giving back is something that's personally important to me. That's why I wanted to definitely be here today. Um, the world is so much bigger than the little box we live in. So if you can give back a few hours here, a few hours there, then it's your way of giving back to the world, giving back to the community, what it's given to you. I think the best quote to sum it up is from Muhammad Ali. He said that charity is the rent that we pay to occupy space on earth. So this is my rent that I'm paying to make sure I'm still able to occupy space here. It's Make a Difference Day and a lot of the schools are cleaning up around and we decided to join. To help we want to school. help the community out, clean it up, make it look better. A day like today proves the fact that people do care about O'Fallon, they do want to make a difference in their community, and they need an avenue in which to get involved, and so we are able to do that for them. It was a great day outside. My partners today at Starbucks, I mean, they had told me about this, and it just seemed like a great day to go outside and help out our community. It feels really good because like I never like because I can know that I like helped cleaned up the like my alligator creek and everything. So it feels really good and I want to come back and volunteer. So Yeah. 
It's just about helping the community and making the the area a better place and just makes gives me a good feeling inside. Volunteers are people wanting to engage with others. They want to make the community a better place. They want to socialize with their neighbors. They want meaningful opportunities that recognize their value. They want to tell people that it's important to be an active participant in life. We are so grateful that you, our volunteers, have chosen to share your passions and your compassions with all of us here at the City of O'Fallon. And when people ask you what you do, we hope you tell them, I volunteer.